Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating connection between smell and memory. Have you ever caught a whiff of a familiar scent and suddenly found yourself flooded with memories? Let's explore why this happens and the science behind it. But before we begin, make sure to hit that likes button and subscribe to our channel for more interesting content. First, let's talk about the brain. The olfactory bulb is responsible for processing smells and is located close to the hippocampus and amygdala, which are involved in memory and emotion. This direct connection means that smells can have a more immediate impact on memory and emotional processing compared to other senses. It's kind of like having a direct line between your nose and your memories. From an evolutionary standpoint, our ability to remember smells was crucial for survival. Our ancestors needed to associate specific smells with positive or negative experiences, like food sources or danger, to make better decisions and adapt to their environment. This could explain why our brains have evolved to form such strong connections between smell and memory. Now let's discuss a phenomenon known as Proustian memory. Named after French author Marcel Proust, this term refers to the experience of smells triggering vivid, detailed memories. Proust wrote about the power of smell in his novel In Search of Lost Time, and this type of involuntary memory can be incredibly potent, often bringing back specific moments or experiences that may have been long forgotten. So, there you have it, folks. The connection between smell and memory is deeply rooted in our brain's architecture and has significant emotional and evolutionary underpinnings. Next time you catch a whiff of your grandma's perfume or your favorite childhood snack, take a moment to appreciate the incredible power of your olfactory system and its ability to transport you back in time. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more fascinating content. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.